Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Heating Up. How's everybody doing? Uh, so as you guys saw, I did uh, have my birthday cake and present and all that for my early birthday, which is actually tomorrow. Um, dog ate the cake, ate my piece of cake, so that was cool, my fault, but I am in a great mood. Um, so going to be doing a sauce review that I've been trying to do for the last four days, but obviously I've been uh, working uh, my new job, so um, haven't been able to, but I am tonight. This is the from Smoke and Ed Curry mustard passion fruit hot sauce with Pepper X. Um, Smoke and Ed's great. Uh, Pucker Butt Pepper Company, if you guys aren't aware, um, he is one of the top sauce makers in the world, I'm thinking. And just a great guy always always gives stuff away like this was a gift from a sauce that I won on his live uh, one second not quite like Tom but uh, Tom's got a crazy collection of pucker butt stuff but I got that one the pucker duck which is really good table sauce really good and the spicy hot version spicy italian which is amazing this one gave um oculi the hiccups so rumor has it oculi's uh, goatee is still hiccuping somewhere wherever it is uh, <laughs> and i also got these which uh this is his smoking ed's special reserve collection they're two ounce bottles i ended up getting these on a giveaway uh that i won they a $10 certificate so I got these five um, which is great because I've only had one of them I believe so uh, Reaper Squeezins the Gator Special Reserve the Extra Mean Green Special Reserve they're all Special Reserve so the Smokin' Ed's Yellow hot sauce blend and which this one's I'm really excited for chocolate plague uh, super excited about that so we got that to review so if you guys haven't checked out pucker butt pepper company please do so Hold on. there we go um, please do so Did you guys hear Johnny lost his laptop yeah, I mean, most normal people that fly with a laptop. Well, you know, let's let's try this out. Let's see. I got this laptop here, the laptop bag. I mean, if if you're not retarded, you take this. Look at this. You take this, and then you zip it all up. Then you can carry on. I mean, that's what I'd do with a laptop that I had my <laughs> my book on. Uh, man, I bet that's not going to get backed up. The backup's going to fucking fail. I bet you any money. We're not going to see that book, man. It's so depressing. Jeez, fucking loser. Anyway, I'm not going to taint a uh, smoking head review any more than I already have. Because that just wouldn't be right. So... On to this. Mustard passion fruit hot sauce. Um, ingredients are water, vinegar, sugar, spices, passion fruit powder, chili powder, salt, and xanthan gum. And uh, it's heated with this. Pepper X. Hope everybody's well. Back to work tomorrow again. Um, my next day off is Wednesday, I believe. Wednesday, Thursday, so I had to work straight through when I gave my notice at the other place, but is what it is. Um, yeah, as you can see, I think that's uh, five flames. This one's kind of dull, but real cool, just plain label. Um, consistency, it's pretty thin. It's pretty thin sauce. So, 
here we go. Let's see if we get a little pop. Probably not. Mm -mm. All right, let's give it the old snifferoo. Wow, it's interesting. It smells like a real hot. I can smell the pepper. It smells like a real hot uh, honey mustard. But I don't know. This one's gonna light me up. I'm assuming this is mustard passion fruit hot sauce. So I can get the old Steve Gillespie. That's probably more than enough. All right. Um, this is mustard passion fruit hot sauce from Smokin' Ed at Pucker Butt Pepper Company, made with Pepper X, the world's hottest pepper. Joe from Heating Up. Cheers. That's really good. I just get a, I don't really, I don't, honestly, never had a passion fruit in my life. But what I get is just a hot, hot mustard tasting sauce. Um, yeah, it's hot, really, just mainly all the tongue, the whole tongue. I swish it around for a little bit. Um, that's really good. This would be good on pizza, um, cause I, I mean, I don't, I don't taste the passion fruit. I think it would be good on pizza. I think it would be good on um, like Italian grinders, uh, chicken fingers. Um, there'd be a lot of good uses for this. So this one's really good. I recommend this one. Um, it's hot for my heat. I'm gonna give that a good solid two out of ten. Um, it still stings, but it's going away. Um, flavor. I wish I could have picked up some fruity notes, but flavor, I'm going to give it a 8.4 out of 10 for flavor. It's really good and it's going to be good on a lot of things. So thank you, Ed. Um, much appreciated. This was a free bottle, so we really appreciate you. Um, and that will do it for this review. Um, appreciate all you, all your love and support. Thank you very much. And uh, I'll be back on tomorrow for my morning cup of joe and maybe another review. So thank you all for joining. Uh, this was Joe meeting up. And I will catch all of you beautiful people on the next one. Have a great night, guys.